my name is René Hartmann and I've been managing Max Detweiler company over the last 12 years. We are a fully owned family company in Switzerland going into its third generation now and that is 65 years after Max Detweiler, after Max Detweiler has founded MDC. We have always been in the field of conception and engineering of high precision equipment and we have always manufactured ourselves from A to Z what we design and what we invent. You know for marketing, sales, after sales, we have over 15 fully owned subsidiaries worldwide and in addition we operate through 30 representatives and dealers. And essential is that in all our thinking, in all our actions, in everything that we do and have done over the last 35 years, uh, everything has been focused and centered to the field of the graphics industry and in particular to the field of gravure. Gravure, a dying printing technology, I read about this, I hear stories about this and I see a lot of people thinking so. I believe in particular this concerns the field of publication printing. However, I and we, all our company, do not share such thinking and fears and effectively I am sure this will not happen. We see a couple of main problems in the, the problems that Gravier faces now worldwide. Uh, sure, the problems are not and have, have never been in the press. They have never been in uh, product finishing. They are not, uh, the problems are not in the paper, they are not in the ink. Really, the one and only problem that we see is time and money in cylinder making. This has been for the last 10, 12 years, as long as, as I've seen this industry, has been the main problem and it's becoming worse in conception, in comparison to what Flexo is able to do, but especially also to what Offset is, is going to do in magazine printing and catalog printing. Maybe there is another substantial weakness of gravure. We believe and see that uh, Gravure does not have really an efficient lobbying. It is not organized as well as Flexo is or as Offset is. We see the branch, Gravure branch organizations in Europe and the United States a little outdated and not anymore in position to do a good job, in our opinion. Our company when it comes to cylinder, making, uh, to cylinder making and to the weakness of cylinder making in time and money, of course our company is in the heart of all this. First of all, we are a member of ERA, ERA we are a member of GAA and uh, we see ourselves and the market sees ourselves also as the number one supplier of uh, cylinder making equipment worldwide. However, we also are one of the major innovators in Gravure and we have brought to market direct laser technology, we have brought to market new materials and we see ourselves now in a period where traditional materials like copper and chrome are rapidly becoming obsolete. As a consequence of this, publication Gravure, magazine catalogs going to direct laser, uh, going to the zinc process, no longer suffers any speed disadvantage compared to offset. There is no penalty, we have proved that with two customers in Germany and in Japan and they both tell me if it comes to criteria like uh, production from data to the truck, to delivered product out of the factory, both of them today are as fast in gravure as in offset using direct laser and using zinc. We see a lot of action there and we see a lot of shift. We see that countries like Poland, like Ukraine, like Russia, as long as we talk about Europe, have become more important production markets and consumer markets than UK and France. If you look farther east, of course, everyone sees China developing. 
since India developing and our company has acted, we have gone to China as a manufacturer uh, four years ago and it's been very successful and after that success we have last year started to build up uh, MDC India as a production site also. So there is no way around that. We have to be present and in these countries you do not it's not sufficient to be present as a sales and after sales organization, we have to be a production organization. Drupa for me personally, it's all, always the same. Uh, Drupa is our customers, our company's customers worldwide. I'm seeing them here. I sometimes feel almost encapsulated on our own booth. Uh, because it, the process is so intense that uh, over the last six days now I've had no opportunity to walk around to see what's on. However, I have my engineers here. They do it. They've been everywhere uh, where it's important for us, but we've not been through the process of analyzing together what they have seen, what's new, my life here is with our customers and that's how Drupa works.